Hey friends, Tim here. Welcome to the Friday Drive and Happy New Year. This is our first Friday Drive after um, the New Year. Hopefully you celebrated, you rested, you recalibrated, you connected um, with family and friends, and, and hopefully it was a great holiday to be with everybody. Uh, but now we're back. Now we're back. We're in the swing of things. Hopefully you guys have kind of emerged. Probably those first few days were um, you know, kind of coming back into the atmosphere and it was a little rough or whatever, but uh, we're kind of settling in now and, and that's what's happening. And so today I want to talk about building trust in your organization. And we've got a whole plethora of tools around this um, here at Five Capitals I want to introduce you to. But um, we, we have a podcast that's talking about it and we've got a whole e-course on it. But I wanted to kind of give you a glimpse of, of what we're talking about here. Um, it's really important as you start the new year off uh, to make sure that the trust meter that you have with your people, that the way your people trust you as a leader um, is strong and that you've done all the hard work, that you've built the relationships, that you've, um, that you've listened well, that you communicate clearly. There's a lot of different aspects to, to building trust in an organization that um, we all need to be thinking about. The one I want to talk about today is just connection, okay? Uh, as you're coming into a new year, maybe, maybe there's been some change that happened at the end of the year. That's oftentimes when change happens in organizations. Um, and so now we're kind of coming in, hoping, hopefully for a soft landing uh, for this new venture that we're on, this, this, this thing that everybody's going on for the new year. Um, and we're trying to create not just vision carriers, but vision casters, right? We're trying to create um, a team that actually will carry the vision with them and things like that. Well, the only way they're going to do that, the only way they're going to get a sense of ownership in the organization uh, and be all on board, be completely dialed in, is if we build trust, right, is if we do some of that. And so the only, there's a number of ways we do that, but, but um, one of the biggest ways we can do that is through connection, all right? And when we talk about connection, we're talking about um, sitting down with folks, uh, listening to, to what's going on in their world, especially if there's been some change. Uh, because oftentimes when we come in with big grand visions, we come in with uh, big ideas about what we want to happen, uh, the plans that we have, the strategies we put in place, we kind of come in going, look, this is new and this is where we're going and we get real excited about it. But a lot of times we don't realize that the people that we're coming in to do this with, um, are, we're pretty comfortable with the way things were at times. They were pretty comfortable with, with how those things were. And so We've got to go in and we've got to spend some time really getting to know them. We've got to spend some time understanding, you know, where is is there discomfort in some of this change that, that we're going through? And so we do that through asking questions. We do that through understanding, hey, how are you processing some of the new things that we have going on? Um, help me understand, you know, how this affects you, maybe even how it affects their uh, their families and, and things like that. Because anytime there's a little bit of change or there's something new that's coming down the pike, um, that connection is the first thing that needs to happen because you've heard the old adage, people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care, right? Um, and we've got to build the equity. We've got to build the trust with people um, through connection. And so sitting down, asking questions, being curious, not judgmental, as you've heard me say a number of times, um, and really going in and understanding who are they, what are their fears, how are they made up, um, in terms of their wiring and things like that? Are they more on the fearful side? Are they more on the adventurous side? Um, can they embrace change a little bit easier? Are they a, a little bit less likely to embrace it? Um, but one of the things you can do is to sit down and just say, hey, tell me your story. Uh, if you don't know them very well, or maybe you do know them well, but you've never really asked, go in and just use this tool that says, hey, tell me your story. And, and I would like to sit and I'd like to listen and find out what's going on. And just, just ask follow-up questions as they're describing their story. Um, use empathic language like, you know, wow, that, that sounds like that was a really hard thing you went through or, you know, that sounds very exciting, the thing you just told me about and, and what that is. Because if you're dialed in and you're fully present uh, with people, you're asking the right questions, then, you know, trust is just going to naturally be, be built just like it is in any friendship, any relationship, those kind of things. So, uh, so I'll leave you with that. And, and again, the powerful tool here is, hey, tell me your story. And then as they're talking, you know, kind of walking through some of those follow-up questions. All right. Now, to give you a much more robust version of this, um, at Five Capitals, we've got a course um, that's called Building Trust in Organizations. And so I'll put that in the, in the email below. You can click on the link. It's a, uh, I think it's a nine-part course. Um, so you go through this. You can go through this by yourself. You can go through it with your people, whatever. It's part of the Anywhere um, uh, uh, platform that we have here where you can get in and look at all of our e-courses, but this is the one that 
um, I think is a great way to start off the new year. So definitely take, take a look at that. And then lastly, we just kicked off um, our podcast a couple months ago. Our third podcast just launched on January 3rd. We'd love for you to take a listen to that. Um, it also is about building trust in organizations. And so it's a walkthrough, kind of an abbreviated version of the e-course and so all these things are really important. And there are a number of steps that are part of this, you know, connection, communication, competence, et cetera, et cetera. So jump in and listen to that. Um, all these things will help you as a leader and they'll help get you off to a great start uh, for the new year. I'm excited about where we're going. Can't wait to hear everybody's word uh, in our coaching calls uh, this week and next week. Um, and for those of you who don't have your word yet, you've got a week. So, um, and then we're going to kind of hold your feet to the fire on that and make sure that you've got something that's kind of leading you through 2024. All right. Appreciate you guys as always. And we'll see you on the next Friday Drive.